we are excited for today because what's today, Dave? Demo day! Demo day! <laughs> we are going to systematically take out the kitchen and hopefully take down the wall between the kitchen and the dining room to get a feel for the space that we have as we work on finishing up the design for the new kitchen. So come along, let's show you how it happens. I've got all of our tools of the trade here today. Sledgehammer, a new blade for the sawzall, and then a couple of these crowbars? What are these called? Lifter yep. bars? Crowbars. Crowbars, and hopefully with these tools and our huge muscles and our big brains, we'll be able to take apart this kitchen, um, the cabinets, and then start working on taking down the wall. And I'm actually really excited to see what's beneath the linoleum on the floor. So I've never demoed a kitchen before, but I read a few articles last night and I feel like we have a pretty good idea of what we're in for. First, I'm just using this razor and I'm cutting around all of the caulk lines around all of the countertops and the cabinets so that when we go to unscrew them, that they'll come off the wall a little bit easier. We'll see. come down but we have the rest of this to take out still it's gonna be easy and hard easy. yes it's gonna be easy to pull up the subfloor better than asbestos I guess so once we pull all of, all of this subfloor out this should be easy to lace through some Hardwood to match. minor run in with a live electrical wire but yeah we, we <laughs> survived can you, can you go back? we were trying to sever these wires and we didn't have the right tools so we used a box cutter but it worked <laughs> what'd you find looks like a little bit of jack daniels Ooh, a little christmas surprise, christmas hidden surprise hidden behind hidden the refrigerator <laughs> just kidding we don't drink we're just gonna throw that Yeah! 
I dreamed about this and I'm loving every minute of it so much. Woo! Let the sun shine in. Come see what I did. Whoa. Whoa. Milo, come see what I did. Awesome. What? Put that one on. <laughs> Can we take out the cabinets down here? You'll be able to. No, no. Hey, there's still something with you. Never impressed. I am never impressed with you. Yeah. All the boys working. It is honestly everything that I thought that I thought it would be and more. It's been so fun to just get in there and make it happen and start to just open things up so that we can figure out what design is going to work really well in here. Doing a quick drink stop for my thirsty construction workers and hopefully we'll get back and be able to finish up taking out all of the kitchen today. I kind of thought it the when we started the day it might be like a two or three or four day process and we've just been busting it out literally and I'm so excited to just get it all done and see what the space looks like with that wall really opened up. Finding remnants of the people who used to live here or their friends. Half a wall, whole wall, and the closet coming out over there. When we started this morning, I told Dave, let's just be really deliberate and like make sure that this stays clean and nice when we're doing the demo. This is what it looks like right now. <laughs> I don't know if you can do a clean, nice demo. It's, it's, a, it's a messy job. Woohoo! It is a hole. <laughs> Straight through all of those studs in between the kitchen and the dining room on at least part of the wall have been taken out. And so this is gonna gives us a little bit better feel of what this might actually be like. So now coming through the dining room, this will be open. This whole wall will be open to the kitchen. So we'll have a lot more visual space happening in here. It's gonna be awesome. That guy's doing good work. That's right. This is my specialty. This is his specialty. Breaking things down. Yeah. Walls. Ah! I just turned ah. on my shoulder. It's coming! It's coming down! Hooray! <laughs> this is the best. To clarify that we're not just blindly knocking down walls. We've had several contractors and a structural engineer in this house talking to us about the different walls and what they support and all the electricity to the whole house is cut off. So we're dealing with electrical wires, but they're all safe. And the wall that we're removing is not gonna affect the structure of the house at all. So it'll just only open up the space and make it so much more light, bright, and beautiful. And the house is going to remain standing. We've been really careful to keep all of the cabinets intact and take the appliances out carefully so that they can all be donated to Habitat for Humanity. So we've scheduled an appointment for Tuesday. They're gonna come pick up all of these intact kitchen cabinets and appliances so that they can be reused in a home of someone who needs it. We're getting so close. It feels so open. It feels so open. <laughs> it feels so open. We should just move in. It feels so open and nice in here. We did it. All of the cabinets, all of the walls that we didn't want, the closet, everything is down. It's all right here. And uh, we're going to have someone come haul it away so we can get started on the fun stuff, which is putting in the kitchen that we really like. We're not gonna do that. We have hired some kitchen installation people to do that and we're excited to just get the ball rolling. It feels so different in here now that everything has broken apart and <laughs> is bigger. Um, so I'm gonna back up and give you a good look at it. So this whole wall used to be blocking the light from those windows and the space and then we have big window in the dining room that we're actually gonna turn into a, a patio door 
so that the kitchen and the living room, which is now, or the um, dining room, can be one continuous space. It's just so much lighter and brighter in here. I want to just have Dave show you a little bit of what we're um, thinking for the kitchen. So over here, where the washer and dryer is built in, next to there we're going to put the um, refrigerator, right here. And there will be a cabinet next to it, facing the dining room this way, so that it'll basically, the wall that we took out right there will basically feel like it's back installed, but it will be cabinetry and the, um, yeah, to open towards this way, and the refrigerator. And then it'll be empty space as a walkway over to the cabinet, all along this wall where the windows and um, doors are, that will just be a long cabinet countertop with open shelving. That this door become is becoming a window and it will just have a wall of tile backsplash, a hood, floating shelving, and a long countertop that will just end where the wall was. So it'll be open above. And then where the refrigerator currently is will be some pantry, floor to ceiling pantry shelving facing this direction, so right, facing so me. Yeah, so you'll open them that way. So we'll have everything we need right in the kitchen and where Dave could walk straight towards me, that will be a walkway. Those like four or five feet will just be a walkway all the way open into this space here. And if he wants to go out to the backyard to play on the playground, he can go right through the door that will be right there. So Dave, how do you feel like demo day went? It was good, it was a good demo day. Yeah, what was your favorite part? My favorite part was probably knocking down the this um, wall. This wall, yeah. You rocked that. That's true. I did. You loved it. <laughs> I felt really powerful when I did it. What was your least favorite part? Um, this part. <laughs> <laughs> if you go closer, I I smashed my finger. Oh, and yeah. it might not be broken. No, I mean I'm still using it. Yeah, we think the more that it's I okay. play with it, the more it feels like it's not broken. Oh, good. What so, about you? What was um, your favorite part? My favorite part was the whole thing. I loved every single bit of it. <laughs> Seriously, I loved like taking out cabinets and watching you tear down the wall and banging through the drywall. And I loved watching the kids like get in on it too. Yeah, the boys yeah, loved it. The boys knock down the wall is fun. The Elliot just came in here a few minutes ago with a hammer and was like, "What can I break next?" I'm like. <laughs> Uh, nothing. <laughs> We're gonna have to like unlearn that skill. Yeah, it's been so great and like I can't believe we finished. We didn't, I don't know what I anticipated. I kind of hoped that we'd just kind of pound through it and we totally did and this whole room has yeah, now been cleared. demoed. Everything cleared out. The walls, the cabinets. I mean, it's just awesome. All we have to do is get rid of all the stuff that we put in Now we just have to get rid of <laughs> Everything that just transferred into the other room, but well, this we're, room's done. <laughs> <laughs> we we hired someone to do that, so that'll be good, hopefully. So um, I'd say it was a successful day. Definitely. Yeah. I'm feeling really good about the progress on this house. We did a good job today. We did awesome. Okay, so so much more to come. Make sure that you tune back in because we ha we still have design, we still have projects, we still have uh, kitchen stuff, installations painting and landscaping and doors and windows and all of the things that are going to happen in this house and we hope that you'll join us for all of it until then have a nice one we'll see you later